I recognize that ass. What's up, brother? How you doing? <laughs> hey, Steve, dude! Good to meet you, brother. What's up, man? Right, hey, right. good to meet you, dude. Cars look right. great. Thank you, thank you. Are you yeah. gonna go drive it? I am. Are you gonna fit in it? I've never, <laughs> never seen <laughs> one, no. It's... They actually call me uh, Butt Gotti, is what they call me. <laughs> Butt Gotti. Yeah. 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 Right, I'm not gonna make the caption on the video. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna walk around, check out some awesome Super Hyper Classics, and hopefully I get inspired to go buy a brand new car. Face left is under that tarp right there. Oh, shit. Cool. just in time for when I got my Euros. I hate having the old body. <laughs> I hate having the older body of a car. It's been Tommy's dream to come to this event for his whole life. Look at literally forever. The GT3 RS was just unveiled. We get to see that. I'm so excited. As long as I can get an allocation, which I hope someone out there will hook it up, then you better freaking believe I'm going to add the GT3 RS to the collection, the 992. Super pumped for that. Even that's a pretty cool spec, I'm not going to lie. Great looking wheels. Absolutely love this GT3 RS. Just want to stress that I'm going to do whatever I can to get an allocation one of these as soon as possible. Dude, I think it looks amazing. The factory roll case is nuts. I I was watching it being unveiled live and I caught a lot of the other subtle subtleties but I didn't catch the roll cage part. Like that's gonna I feel like I should be scared about that. <laughs> like, no. like they're building a factory car with a roll cage. No, it's good. Uh, I think you should do Ruby Stone Red. He was like, I don't I don't know if I want to do pink, but I think Ruby Stone one of these would look awesome with carbon fiber. I don't mind like adding a pink car to the collection, but that's typically something I would wrap because I think it'd be tough to sell. And I'm just not I don't mind pink, like I'm wearing a pink shirt kind of. Um, I love that. They I kept love it. that. They kept it with a, a huge wing. It resembles the Senna wing, which is the coolest looking wing I think of the whole collection. Expect one of these in my garage soon. I, I just need to determine if I'm going to keep my other GT3S that I love so much or trade that in. I may need to trade it in. All right, next up. On the next. We actually had John Hennessy reach out to us and they were trying to get us into one of these cars. They're just around $2 million. Aren't they like 2,000 horsepower too? They're a lot, yeah. Um, it's it's a badass car. I'm seeing it first. It's really nice. I don't think it quite has the wow factor some of the other Hypers that I've got in mind, but uh, maybe maybe in the future, but this is not the car for me just yet. It might I change me. Pretty cool. It's the first time seeing one in person, obviously, but... They said they'd um, take me in a drive, didn't they? I'm they did, yeah. This car's logo to Chicago as well. Yeah, taking me for a drive might be dangerous. I might, I might fall in love with yeah. it. Yeah. There's a video uh, at the Goodwood Festival of Speed where this car is shooting like six foot flames. See if you could rip rock one of these. Like but untuned, like from the factory? No, from the factory, like <laughs> to here. Yeah. How does that pass? Insane. How does that pass government regulations? Look at the cover, look at the car cover on whatever this is. It looks like it's going to be something crazy. I mean, you could tell it's some wow. version of the... Some version of the wire. This is Stefano first. Hi. Hey! hey. Stefano. Are you guys unveiling this? Five minutes. Five, five minutes, all right. Hi. 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 How's it going, Hi. Thomas? Hi. Nice to meet you. Hi. David. Hi. Nice to meet you. Very good to meet you. Love your car. Love, love the Pagani, sir. Thank you. This year. Have fun. That's pretty crazy. That thing looks like a straight race car. Look at that. Look at the wing. The Mercy Lago SV is one of the very few cars that I am like adamant needs to enjoy the club. Dude, look at this thing. I'm not I'm not against the Mercy Lago. I just we remember when we agreed what how did we bet? Best, Best driver competition in our video we did. I won it. Okay. So I was a standard first. A standard Mercy, not a, an SV. So I went. No, yes. No. This is the exact color that I want to do on this year on SS. It's Lamborghini Grigio Telesto. What do you think? I think that we, I think we do a PTS color, but I also think that we scale back on a little bit of the black stuff on the interior. I want that color really bad. Like that's that's the color. That's gorgeous. We should. I love the Diablos. Diablo first, Tommy. Uh, just for, I didn't even know that Gunther Works was here, but the dude that owns Vorsteiner also owns Gunther Works. I went and visited Peter from Vorsteiner. And uh, he basically said he can get me into a Gunther Works Porsche. They look amazing. Even the full inside body. Everything. Like the chassis is carbon. But I would have to drive it. I, I couldn't, it couldn't stay clean like that. I would consider one. This one's a little more clean and classic colors, I think. If I'm, if I'm picking one of the three, it might have, man, that black carbon body actually is pretty badass. That, that, wing, that wing is ridiculous. 
I think uh, I think I'm actually even though I don't think I'll ever get a Bugatti convertible, I'm super excited to check this out. It's definitely cooler than I thought it would be. <laughs> that's pretty. That's a neat sound. I think that Tommy and I were just discussing how it looks like they built the car around the engine. The engine fits absolutely perfectly in there. Look at that. Come on, Tommy, let's see the engine, bro. Out of the vehicle. This engine is the size of my mom's mini. Great. Yes. Oh, yeah, the quad yeah. turbos? Yes. Two on each side. <laughs> That's cool to see that out. Transmission. Needs a, needs a little work. <laughs> yeah. needs, needs a little work on the shifting, like shifting into drive, shifting into reverse. We did that. A little laggy, but hopefully, I wonder. We should ask. We should ask them if they if they made some software or improvements to the transmission because I think I've said it before. That's my only complaint. I love. I actually love, love, love the Bugatti. I refused to drive my P1 this whole trip. We went from Vegas to LA to here. Drove the Bugatti the whole way. Yeah. Um, but transmission. Hopefully they've got it fixed. Good. Want to say hi, sir? You're welcome. Really good to see you. Having fun? Yeah. Good to see you. Hi. Hi. Steve. This thing's insane. Can you imagine uh, this coming out in '67? Oh. Uh, looks like a freaking spaceship, dude. They actually are showing the brand new Batmobile for the new movie. Check that out. Brand new. You know, in, all, in all seriousness, I was just telling Tom, like, I would rock the. F out of that on the street. I would drive that thing and I would love every fucking minute of it. We are literally on the stand with the brand new Koenigsegg that was released this morning with Christian von Koenigsegg sitting in the car checking it out. This is so cool. He's about to start it. <laughs> Oh my god, I saw the video you, of your shit. Oh my gosh, I know. Oh my god. Ouch. Oh, it was like Ouch. My it was, seat. We thought it was going to be bad, like up the side. It was actually only about this wide down the very inside, but it still yeah. sucks. It, it always sucks. sounds worse than it is. <laughs> yes, yeah. yes. But that, yes. that was painful to watch. Good to see you, brother. Likewise. Have fun, man. Genuine dude that's literally right out here meeting with anybody and everybody. God bless him. Progressive. I love it. Hello, sir. I'm Steve. I got a Yesco and a Yamira on order. I just oh, wanted wow. to say I appreciate your work. Amazing. Well, fantastic. I'll be specking one tonight at right. 5 o'clock. Yeah, amazing. Thomas. Would you, would you mind if I fangirl and you sign three of my ass for my kids? And you're going to let me buy that. You had a pen. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. He, is a, he is a good guy. Yeah. Perfect. There you go, sir. Thank you. This is version 2.0 of the Rolls Royce Phantom, so this is the first time we're seeing this. We saw the ghost that had the facelift. Look at the gray and black. Starry night. Starry night in the headlight. We're checking out the Gordon Murray T50. He's actually right there. Uh, he designed the McLaren F1, for those of you who don't know. Um, an absolute automotive legend. Mr. Murray, would you just open to shake your hand, sir? Thank you. Thank F1, you. beautiful. Thank, Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Appreciate it. Where, where are you at? Thank you. Thank you. Very nice to meet you, sir. Have a good day. Enjoy the show. I caught a glimpse of it out of the corner of my eye and it looks identical. What do you think? Let's look at it. I, I barely, I didn't, I didn't look at that part. It looks like a Mansory kid, Uris. It's got, it's got a little, like, and it looks as close to the other one as possible. Was this just a, this is a facelift, right? Yes. Wait, some dude was just walking in it, can't we? Better to ask for uh, forgiveness than permission. Oh yeah. Because I, and I did so much carbon on mine. Yeah. I'm actually I feel good about this. Yeah. I'm gonna shut the door. That's sweet. Uh, look at my uh, Porsche 918 spec. You like that. <laughs> The quail was super fun, the weather was really nice, we got to see some pretty awesome cars. I think I was most excited by just seeing the Koenigseggs in person. Yeah. What what excited you most? I don't know. Uh, meeting Horatio and, and Christian von Koenigsegg, were, yes. that was super cool, like all-time dream was unexpected. for me. It was. Seeing the new Bugatti was amazing. Yeah. Um, Good call, that was better than expected. Yeah, very cool. Um, overall, for a first, first visit to Car Week, I'm, I'm actually excited. This is a good time. We were able to walk through in just a few hours. and. That's good for me. It was casual. I liked it. Yeah. Awesome. All right. We'll see you next year. See you next year. Hey, Steve. What's up, bro? Oh, that man is tight. <laughs>